BSP is a very popular threading standard for connecting pipe accessories. However, it is not so easy to understand. The jargon, the calculations, and the charts describing it are very different from standard inch and metric threads. Erez here from the Machining Doctor website. Stay tuned and let me show you everything you need to know about it. Hello, and welcome to another episode of the Machining Doctor Classroom. Here are the topics that will be covered in this video. What is a BSP thread? BSP thread descriptions. BSPT threads, including geometry, series, and classes. And finally, BSPP threads. BSP is a British standard for pipe threads defined by ISO 7 and ISO 228. It is the most commonly used pipe thread system outside the USA. In North America, the more popular standard is NPT. Check out the video on the above card if you are interested in that. Although it is a British standard and the nominal pipe sizes are in inches, the dimensions are defined in millimeters. Let's start by understanding its designations. It will always start with BSP, followed by the letter T for tapered or P for parallel. Next, followed by a space, we have a one to two letter code specifying the series. I will thoroughly explain the different series later in this video. Followed by another space, we have the nominal pipe diameter, given in inch fractions. Finally, again, followed by a space, we have the letters A or B for the tolerance class, which is given only for the G series. Now that the description is clear, let's discuss each family and series further. All the families and series share the same basic profile with a 55 degree truncated and rounded triangle. We will deal first with BSPT. As you remember, the letter T stands for tapered, and the profile is titled by an angle of 1.79 degrees relative to the thread axis. It creates a seal when the threads are torqued, as the flanks of the external and internal threads compress against each other, and the use of an O-ring is optional. A BSPT thread can belong to one of three series, R, external tapered, RC, internal tapered, or RP, internal parallel. The external, R thread, can be assembled on either RC or RP internal threads. The inspection of tapered threads differs from what we are used to in the more common parallel threads, since the diameters vary as we move along the thread's axis. The primary parameter is the gauge length, denoted by LG. It defines the distance from the thread's end, at which the measurements of diameters are made. The tolerance of LG is defined by the number of turns that the gauge can make from the nominal point. The thread length, L, is the distance to the last useful thread. A thread is considered useful according to the amount of crest truncation. The threads beyond this point are called vanished threads and this area of the thread is called washout. BSPT threads don't have different tolerance classes. Therefore, a class is not part of their description. In addition, most of the dimensions can be inspected only with gauges. The tolerances for the gauges are defined in ISO 7-2 and are outside the scope of this video. Now, let's move on to the BSPP family of parallel threads. BSPP has only the G-series and is sometimes nicknamed G-threads. Since it's a parallel thread, its parameters and inspection techniques are the same as for standard inch and metric threads. In this family, an O-ring is mandatory to form a seal. If no class is indicated, we are designating an internal thread. If a class is indicated, it means we are referring to an external thread. In such a case, there are two options. Class A indicates an external, high-precision thread, and Class B, a low-precision thread. The tolerance field of Class B is twice than that of Class A. So that's it for today. I hope you found the video informative and helpful. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. See you on the next one. Bye.